So let me ask a, a provocative question, perhaps. Is it possible that what President Trump said last Wednesday around noontime was actually protected by the First Amendment? I mean, back, back when I took Con Law 2, there was Brandenburg against Ohio that it had to do with the Ku Klux Klan. And some people are saying that that actually might protect him from prosecution, certainly. No way. I'm a strong First Amendment advocate, but this is worse than yelling fire in a crowded theater. This is more like the Reichstag fire. Brandenburg says that you are protected by, if you just advocate, except when you're inciting imminent lawless action. This guy was inciting not just imminent lawless action, but the violent decapitation of a coordinate branch of the government, preventing this peaceful transition of power and putting a violent mob into the Capitol while he cheered them on from his safe position watching television in a tent. This is not protected by Brandenburg. That, too, is a complete distraction.